What's up guys and welcome back, we're here with another episode of our Thrones of Britannia campaign, playing as Wessex. This is episode 4, and in the last episode we did take Hunterdon, and I think we also took like, Ligeris, we took a lot of stuff, and we we made some pushes, we got up here I think, and we're now sieging down Steanford, so we will be eliminating this faction, the Lederborg, another Viking faction, and we're new, soon to be going to crushing the better Borg as well. All ending in Org. Very, uh, very handy. But I mean, this uh, Resolute Wall here is just recruit a few more units. Things like, um, what did we recruit? Some Sir Laxman, I think, and some Thane Horsemen. So some pretty decent units. Um, yeah, nothing else I really want to recruit now. Looking good on food. Uh, 171. And, I mean, we're also looking, I mean, we're looking good everywhere else and money as well. But just thank you all for the support recently on the channel. Keep it up, guys, with uh, likes, subscribes, comments. And there is a Discord in the making. I'm currently making it. Um, it there may be a link dropped uh, soon. It'll either be in this this one or in the next one. And you're then very well free to join it. Um, there are a few people already in it. But um, they're just kind of usually do, they're doing some work on it. Uh, and trying to make it all perfect for you guys. So you have no problems. So anyway, on with the episode. And uh, I think we're we'll probably ending the turn. I was going to attack this army, but I'd rather have them come and attack me, and they can be the aggressor. Um, attrition, yeah, that's the king's army. You can take attrition. Um, I don't think I. Yeah, I'd rather just let you just siege them out. I probably am going to let this army, uh, well, lose, win against this army, and then send that army up north because this army can reach quite happily to that settlement. So we're going to end the turn. And we'll see what happens. Hopefully, uh, we have a battle pretty soon. That'll be pretty good. A battle of the ages. It's the suit. Oh yes, and of course these Viking raiders have appeared in the south. I almost forgot about them. Um, so yeah, we need to do something about them. We've got an army on our, its way down, but we're gonna need some uh, some more troops. It looks like the South Saxons did some sort of attack, but didn't do a lot. The cowards. Here we go, it's these guys, the Nordmen. Okay, they did destroy an entire army. That is worrying. And West Moringus is gone. And we've lost... Oh, that's attrition, of course. Oh, yeah, I don't care. I don't care. You can... You're not having any, any stuff from me. Um, construction complete, yes. Well done. Well done, you. Skills available. Aelfric, he is a governor. I would like him to... Probably that one probably pretty good and then wolf Sidge, he can have what's this one? Oh, he's a general oh we definitely want command a range on you then sir you've got to well just keep moving south keep on moving keep on moving uh, this is an 8 army I mean it's against 11 I think we could beat this stuff they're, they're getting pretty battered and I don't know if I can recruit stuff in these regions possibly I'm not sure but anyway we're going to... I don't know. We could possibly attack this army. I mean, it's in fortified position. I don't really want to. Could we... Shut up, love. I don't need to see your advice. I've turned you off so many times. Um, they're going to retreat. They're going to surrender in so many turns. And they're, they're, they're starving in there. Um, I'm fine with just leaving them to do their thing. Um, I mean, we do outnumber these guys now. I don't know what their quality's like. Thanes, it's pretty, pretty, oh, there's some sword herdmen, they're pretty good, if I remember. Oh, we have some royal thanes. Hell yeah, why not, let's get some royal thanes in this army, the resolute wall. I mean, they should really win the king's army, but, I mean, we can't go wrong with having some swords, some uh, royal thanes. Um, some additional swords, uh, don't really need that. This uh, area is entirely secured. A mine could be pretty useful. Would hurt the public order. What is the public order like here at the moment? It's at plus one. Yeah, we could do with maybe some better public order before I put a mine in. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll put a put a great hall in here, and we'll put in. Oh, I can't really. Use, I haven't got any money for anything else. That is sad. Um, yes, I doubt I can really. I doubt I can move anything too quick. I'll just, uh, uh, attrition. Yeah, I'm not too fussed about anything else there. We'll just leave that. Uh, 
Let's see if those Nordmen do anything. See whether they... Okay, better Borg's just going to move on by and it's going to raid. So I'm going to probably attack them this turn. I've had a, I can't have them raiding. One thing about... There's there's raiding and then there's... Uh, well, there's, there's fortifying yourself in my land and then there's raiding. Uh, I could also just take your settlement, but I'd rather kill your army. I don't know if you can raise... Actually, you definitely can raise armies in like, small villages, but they can't raise anything quick enough. They're now just a, yeah, King's Army, well, that's fine. Northern Wind turns. Oh, declare war North Umbria. I could do that. I can do that. Indeed. Right, we're going to move our army there. We're going to also now defend Sloisig or whatever it's called. Um, they may just go f turn around and go the other way. That is perfect. They actually couldn't reach it. Decrees. Um, I could enact this, get 10 faction. I'm not so worried about this. Yeah, I'm not worried about that. Um, yeah, where's that raiding army? I'm going to attack it this turn. Yeah, attack. They're going to retreat. They're going to get killed. I'm probably just going to all resolve this one. That's very good odds. Chop his head off. It's the same animation, but, you know, you can't complain. Take on the warriors. It's actually probably a better way of uh, recruiting an army. Taking on their warriors. I'm going to actually just move into Badenford for this turn. Just to like get the extra replenishment. And I can't really recruit anything I'm too pleased with. What are, What's it looking like here in the odds? Still not looking great. But they're going to surrender in a few turns time. Oh, they, that's when they start taking attrition. Two turns time. Okay, traits gained. Cool. Right, well, oh, well yes, he's taking attrition. And where? Um, you're a governor. I will give you... Also, scribe, there you go, you can start taking some more income. I don't know if we can actually, I don't want that one, go away. I want to look at this one. I don't know if I have any civic stuff here. Oh yes, I have now have agriculture, that is pretty good. I will probably start going down that one next. And we have military support. Fist fights, what does that do? What does a fist fight do? Unlocks arena building chain. I'm not quite sure what an arena building chain does. but. We'll probably get some of it somewhere. Um, Dorchester, I could do extra money. Does damage economy, but that's not the end of the world. Nordhume. Um, we could do. I mean, what have we got in Winchester? I mean, we have we haven't actually really built anything in our capital or down here. This is actually this could be quite a ha could be quite handy. Um, or we could build. Yeah, we haven't actually built anything here in these like orchards. We probably should do something like here. Uh, let's put in an orchard. Yeah, let's have an orchard. Build some orchards. And I think we've moved this army, haven't we? Yep. Yeah. So this army can't really do anything. This is a pretty weak army now. I'm not too scared about this. Viking javelin. And yeah, I'm not too scared about this army now. Lord, pu low public order. Yeah, I know you're all really unhappy and like you need you need stuff in your life, but we're gonna sort that out in a bit. Actually, to be fair, we've got an orchard here. We should probably actually put an orchard in this region as well. That might be next turn's uh, stuff. But, I mean, yeah, these ones don't like it, us, but we're going to go for London, and we're probably going to change that, and they'll love us then. And then the Fens. Yes, the Amford that we're taking, so we'll sort the problems out here as well. So we'll end the turn, and we will see what happens. Good to have destroyed that other army. We'll see if they recruit another one. If they do, it'll be bare bones at best. I mean, I probably, yeah. Oh no, the whatever they are have taken it. That's fine. They can take it for now. I will just take it off them in a minute. And I should really go to war with Northumbria. But I don't really want to because it's not really what I want to go next. I know that that's what it's telling me to do. And I should really listen to my uh, superiors, a.k.a. the uh, the AI. But, you know... I'm just calling the AI more superior to myself. Fact faction destroyed, better Borg, and someone else. I mean, wow, wow. That is a lot of factions just to die. <laughs> Jesus. I mean, I say Jesus, but Jesus isn't in this heathen land. Right, anyway. Let's get a small orchard going. Um, that'll help with public order. Train fighters, excellent. Right, so that's replaced uh, Earl Stains with Danes and Fjord. Or oh, Earl's Thane, no, replace Thanes with Earl Thanes and replace Sir Axman with Feared Axman. And we're going to start doing agriculture. Because I'd like some agriculture. And I wonder whether we now have 
Oh yeah, see, we can now upgrade these guys. For a cross... Oh, why am I... Oh, I've spent all my money, of course, on flipping... Um, orchard. I was wondering why I had no money. Uh, yeah, we'll send you up here. I imagine you're pretty beaten up still, yes. You just carry on sieging. Alfred, don't worry about it. Low loyalty? We can't have that. You, you're on one loyalty. Oh, maybe we can't afford that orchard then this turn. Because we're going to have to sort out this man's loyalty first. That's going to cost 900. Uh, bribe him with words. There we go. It's sorting him out ever so slightly. Not really that great. What can I do? Adopt? I don't know if I really want to adopt him. He's not like... Oh, seek a wife for you, yes. Sure. Uh, take her hand, sure. I'm not... S oh, I probably should have just, like, got who whoever's getting an alliance. But, I mean, there's no one actually out there in the world I really want an alliance with. I've sorted out his, his loyalty a little bit. I'll try and sort it out again. Is he a general or a... What are you? You're a governor? I don't know what you are. Where are you? Yes, you're governor of West Sussex. Uh, West... Wessex, not West Sussex. West Sussex. Wessex, Jesus. Can't even say can't even say my own faction's name. That's embarrassing. Um I think we'll fight this one. I think it'll be good to just kill some guys off. So we will fight this one and uh have a glorious, glorious battle. And see who comes out on top. Hopefully it loads in quickly enough. I mean uh, Wolf Sage, I don't know. Would we win this? I'm not sure. I think we will. I mean, I don't think they've got much quality. I mean, they have a lot of chevrons. Jeez, their king's quite good. That is a very good king, actually. It's got three sh silver chevrons. I should not be uh, so confident about this one. I mean, all their other stuff looks pretty light. I mean, these guys are probably pretty good, but they're very, very weak. I mean, my army's basically fresh, but it's pretty much full of crap. But hey, that's how we're going to win this war. We're going to win it with an army full of rubbish and just hope that we uh, we do okay. I mean, this looks like a very great map. But just, I, The quality is quite funny, I think. Just like the trees just like dotted around. It's just a bit bizarre. But there you go. That didn't take too long. Uh, fog now. Get away from that. Let's have... Oh, rain? No. What is this rubbish? There we go, dry. Took about... However many attempts. Uh, let's... Oh, I do apologize. Um, let's just put them like so. I'm probably just going to have a spear front line like there. I'll have these swords in behind to just fill in the gaps. Probably with my general. Um, Cav can just go out here. And archers can just kind of do their thing back here. I don't know. That That's pretty basic. Shut up. I'm pretty sure I turned off all advice, but I mean, they still are insistent on just turning up. Yeah, we must be outnumber them. I think it's just their quality of how good they are. I mean, let's have a quick look at them. I mean, Viking Raiders, hey? These guys look pretty... I like them. They, I mean, they look like stuff straight out of, like, Last Kingdom or Vikings. I've been watching a lot of Last Kingdom recently, just catching up on already what I've already seen. But, you know, it's so good I'd watch it again. And I did. What else have we got back here? Axe Freeman. I mean, you look very similar to Ax uh, to the Viking Raiders, I won't lie. And these are what I was a bit worried about, I think. This unit here, long axes, yes. I thought they were going to be long axes, but... Not too worried, to be honest. Uh, and this is the Hearthguard. Yeah, these guys do look a bit more elite. They've got helmets, they've actually got chainmail. We'll focus them down with our arrows. And they have no cav. Which is going to be useful. I'm probably just going to form a load of shield walls and... Uh, and uh, move them forward. So let's just do that. There we go. I'm probably just going to move you actually wide. And they've got no arches either, I don't think. So we can probably just... Not that it's really great. Here they come? No, they're just forming shield wall. Okay. Intra oh, no, they do have arches. Of course, they have javies over here. You keep running away then. Did we lose any men? No, they're just not quite full strength, this army. Uh, Yeah, we're definitely not fighting the Axe Freeman. Um... What the heck are you doing? Can we focus down the general? Yes, we can. Please shoot him. 
There, there we go. You stupid man, just carry on. Carry on as you were. Um, I guess move forward a bit more. Actually, just move everything but you forward like that. What is the cavalry doing? You idiots. I've just lost like a few men for no reason. Six good men died because the AI just decided. Yeah, there we go. I can run down those long axes. God's sake. Oh, they do have Viking hunters actually. Shoot them. There you go. Form shield wall. Oh, you can't do it because you're in shield wall there. Just do that then. And you go through there. And, I mean, it looks really cool. I will admit, the shield wall just look really cool. I mean, with crappy units, not so cool. Um, but get out of shield wall. You're not needed in shield wall either. Are you winning this fight? I don't want you in here any longer, though. Um, surround these guys, please. Keep running. Oh, of course you're breaking. What is the point in you? You've not actually improve, impressed me at all this entire get battle. I'm just going to say. Just going to say. There we go. These guys in circle now. These guys are in for a, a real treat. You're not getting out of that one, pal. I would not want to be in surrounded by all these guys. All these cr all this crap. I mean, apart from the Thanes, they should be okay. Let me shoot these guys down for once. Is those cavalry still breaking? Long axe. Yeah, that's fine. You, you're not too worried. Uh, where are all their bows? Viking jabbies. Okay, they've got all the bows over there. Let's just go and deal with these then. Useless. Actually a useless. No. Where are they? Viking hunters. They've run them down. Yeah, um, okay, my arch is broke. I need more arches in this army, in fairness. That's not, that was always evident. Uh, you pull away, <laughs> run these guys down. There we go, okay. We'll probably wrap this one nicely up now. Very good, very good. Run these guys down. They're still shooting you at point blank range though, of course. I mean, I expect you to win as well, Wolf Sig, or whatever your name is. Win and make me, get me go, get me honor. Oh yeah. What did I expect, really? To be honest, this flipping cavalry is useless for some reason. <laughs> um, archers, just focus down. I don't know their archers. But I am enjoying watching this in circle, and that's pretty. Oh, it just finished. Damn it. Um, run down their archers. Though it could be quite hard. Oh, no, the cavalry's back. You brave, brave fellows. Yeah, just keep running these guys down, for God's sake, please. Oh, general ones. Let's just surround. Yeah, that's the cavalry gone for fun the final time. Never employing scout cavalry again. <laughs> I mean, I will. They're so cheap and they're, they're pretty good. I mean, they were awful. Somehow they still lost to like half a dozen archers. But I mean, these this general unit's holding well. I mean, no surprise it's up against the weakest stuff I have. But hey, it's looking good. It's looking good. Oh, nice kill, sir. Promotion for you. And what have we got left? Oh, it's just some javis. Yeah, it'd be handy if I had that cavalry again just to run these guys down. Oh, is that everything breaking now? I think it is. There we go. That cavalry wasn't needed. I'm not going to even try and chase anything down. I can deal with... I don't think they have enough men left now. 90 men left. They can't, don't think they can do any trouble now. Excellent! We have won! We have won! 
46 kills for those cavalry. That is just appalling. Take on warriors. Three units left. Battered and beaten. And I could... Can I? I can't recruit. That's annoying. I wish I could really could recruit. Um, with what's left. But I can, I can take on... I can replenish. That's fine. I'll auto-resolve this one. 45 men. Oh, less than 90. Wow. It said 90 men remaining, but not even that many. There we go. They're gone. My hard work. The Nordmen are dead. Yes, that's fine. We can deal with those raiders. And now we can just give you some stuff, I guess. Loyalty's okay. I'm not too worried about that. Um, I mean, it could be better. could be better. Could we... Improve it? I'm pretty sure you can, can't you? This one, yeah. There you go. Priest. Make you better. There we go. Perfect, right. And since he's a general, I guess he doesn't his he's not actually affected by the whole Oh, we can upgrade you. Sure. So now you're third feared axeman. Yeah, go up there. They're taking attrition, aren't they? No, apparently not. Apparently here's okay. They're not starving. Um, I'll build a uh, orchard next turn. That's not the end of the world. I don't think there's anything else I really want to spend my money on. There's, uh, there's not really buildings I want to build either. Could build that. Does damage the economy a little bit more. Um, yeah, go on, I will. I think that then it allows me to unlock more stuff here, which is what you need to do. You need to keep building to unlock more stuff. So, not the end of the world. We'll end, end the turn, and we'll see what happens. Right. I think we can win this. I don't think they have enough... Well, apparently we'll win it with an auto-resolve. I don't know if we would. Um, I'm going to pull back. It's a probably not the best move, but I'll pull back for this turn, and my other army is coming up anyway. I'm not too fussed. Um, it'll take me one turn just to re-siege it, and that's not the end of the world. I probably could have won it, maybe. I said I had more, I had more troops... Oh, that's interesting. Was that in my land or was that in someone else's land? This is not my land. This is English Rebels. This is Oxford Narden. Okay, I actually do need that to complete West Sayx, though. Oh, no. Yeah, I do, actually. This is West Sayx, apparently. This is Wessex? This isn't Wessex. Wessex is down here. But, um... I mean, I could improve public order. I will do that. Actually, no. I was going to... Eh, well... Actually, I'm not... Public order's not a problem here. It's food's a problem here. Um, anyway, we're going to build that orchard up here because they need to improve their public order. So, Rochbury gets its thing. It's a lovely little uh, orchard. There you go. Um, we can also improve these. Get some Fjord Axemen in there. That's fine. Um, build that. Build that. Build that. No, nothing more. Thank you. Uh, oh, you can't now upgrade them now that they're there. Okay, that's fine. Um, where can you go? I'd like you to go here. Thank you. Resolute wall. Then we'll take Stanford next turn. And low loyalty, yes. Oh, two people on low loyalty. Not great. Not great. Um, you and you. You're both on two. I can probably afford to get you both like happy in a few turns time um, attrition low public order fine I will I mean to be honest if they're both governors I'm gonna just give them the like the public the uh, ability just to have higher loyalty I could do a send that army where is it this army I've just dealt with the Nordman north I will send it north and I'll try and take snipe maybe this region from the might send my army to Dorchester for a bit recruit an army and then just go across the border be handy and then we could use this as a way to go after Gwynd, take all their land that they take from Mercia back. Could be pretty handy. We will see. We will see. Who else is going to die in this episode I wonder? I've, I mean enough people have already 
like enough factions have died out already. It's pretty uh pretty brutal. I mean, I think we're going to kill Stianford off or whoever they're called. Dyflin goes over the top. All minor Viking sea factions and I will become a vassal of Dyflin. Okay. That's pretty good for Dyflin, I guess. Is that the point? Yeah, so they've now got Dyflin now. <laughs> what? Okay. So they have a few vassals. Or well, they have more vassals. Was I I'm supposed to have gone to war, aren't I, with flipping where was it? Where's my missions? That's family tree objectives. Where's missions? I, s I hate this UI. I hate it so much. Anyway, Eofwald. He is a governor. Oh no, he's not. He's a general. He's got pretty good um, loyalty. I'm going to make him. I'll make him a siege engineer. Could be pretty handy. For a few further on. There we go. All's resolved. Take that. Lovely. I'll be aggressive. Chop this man's head off. Lands in his in his settlement. And there we go. We take we take Stianford. And we'll occupy. Thank you. Yes. I don't need to subjugate any more people. Lederborg has been taken. And we'll uh, repair all this stuff here. All this all this rubbish. Um, what else have we got? No, not needing to do any of that. I could do with maybe building... Hmm. There was a place, was it up here? It might have been this one. It may have been. Ah, it was one of these down here. I would like to build a farm. There you go, and the cockerel goes, starts making noises. Perfect, right. Um, You can't recruit anything because you're not in the city. But this man, Alfred, he can recruit stuff. Um. Bloody scout carry, they're really useless. <laughs> um, I'll probably get some Fjord Axemen. They're pretty good. Um, I imagine well, their Searle Axemen weren't awful. So Fjord Axemen, they've got to be better, surely. Um, that'll do. Uh, government available. The Fens. The Fens has a governor available. I guess we could add a governor. I mean, who's got good loyalty? Influence. We don't know how good your influence is, though. Muster. I mean, none of you are actually very good for governor. Let's just be honest. Um, but I guess we put you in charge of the fence. I have no idea how good your loyalty is. I, that's just a bit frustrating. Oh, I don't have the sufficient. I don't have funds to give a governor. I'm sorry. I don't even have funds to sort out the loyalty of men. It would seem. Um, you game lame. No. Enemy. Oh no. Apparently. Enemy, that damages enemy or morale, not... Don't get that, but okay. <laughs> Apparently an old wound is effect, affects how good you fight. Um, should really affect how good you fight, but no, apparently it scares the enemy. Um, this army can move north. Um, I get, I'll just keep it moving. Oh god, I don't want it doing that. No, just go to there. Go to there, you fool. And uh, we'll end the turn probably for one final time, and we will see what the damage is. And we'll see whether we can uh, win this. Well, win this. We can win this settlement. I don't I don't think we will. We've got a few more turns till we reach there. I was hoping that I did see that faction there. Was hoping that they were just going for Stanford when it was uh, being taken by me, but they, which they did. So they. Uh, They've turned back around. It is probably time to go to war with East Engel, which will be the plan. Uh, probably to probably send one army over this sort of way through the one, well, maybe not through the marshes. I'm not sure. It doesn't seem like a very pleasant way to go. Where the heck is that? Oh, that's an island. Intervene. Give your blessing. Characters marry. At lower influence. Um, I'll give my blessing. Yeah, sure. Abundant harvest. Woo. That sounded so happy that, that we had an abundant harvest. Of course, that's great. Well done. Oh, cavalry. Nice, we now have cavalry stuff. And spears. And look, stained spearmen. Oh, they could be handy. Um, mm, I'd like to get this fist fights thing. But then also this is pretty good. Let's get some stained spears going. Military all the way, I say. Can't go wrong there. Um... Who are you, and can you be upgraded? Yes. I'm going to sort out my low... Uh, oh, gosh, yeah, I really need to sort out this. 
Um, you're on two. I'm going to just kind of just probably spend all my money on this now. Bribe with words. Bribe with words. <laughs> and you can't do anything. No. How sad. You're my heir, Althelm, and you are just a statesman. I don't know. But we sorted out the loyalty of two of the problems. So, yes, we're not spending any money on an economy this turn, but that is fine. We can live with that. I really... Oh, the East Engle has an army here. Well, I'm not a fan of that. I'm going to send my army down to Huntington. Hunterton. Hunterton. Um, I will upgrade you. These stains here. Have some Earl stains. And my first, probably my first attack will be to go to Elig and then Grantenberg. Or how, how do you say half these names? And then I'll probably also attack St. Albans from one of these places and maybe London. I don't know. I'm... Yeah, I probably will attack. I mean, this army's probably going to go down to like outside St. Albans. Then I'll probably have that third army wherever it is after it's dealt with this rebellion over here. Go after London. And then the other army up here can either play... The King's army can either play a defensive or it can go straight in for like Grantenberg or whatever it's called. Whatever it's called. Um, you could recruit... Um, archers could be handy. Which army needs archers more? You probably need archers more, if anything. There you go. You only have two. But there you go. A third arch is always handy. And we... Oh, a risk of rebellion in South Mer Mercia. Why do you hate me all of a sudden? Allegiance, taxation. Okay, well we may have to put down a rebellion here in a few turns time. So this King's Army may not be able to go to war yet. So it may have to turn around and go back and deal with a rebellion. Which is fine. We can do that. But anyway guys, that is probably where I'm going to wrap up the episode. If you've enjoyed... Oh wow, our fjord is way too high. Okay, maybe we shouldn't have done that. Um, but oh well, we'll... How do you increase the fjord then? I don't know. I'll have to check that. I presume you just increased it. Do you just increase it through tech, possibly? I'm not sure. Uh, who knows? But anyway, guys, that's where I'm going to wrap up this episode. If you've enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe. And go and check out the Discord if the link is already there. If not, then you'll have to wait till the next video, probably. And then it'll probably be up, because it is probably within about 24 hours um, time of being ready. But anyway, guys, if you've enjoyed... I. Uh, Leave a like and subscribe. And until next time, Legionnaires, bye for now.